Good morning, folks. So, uh, some of you have actually been asking about the brick wagon. Uh, no, I didn't sell it. Uh, it's still here and it still starts up at one crank. Although, what I've always propagated about preventive maintenance, as I was driving along, the, uh, the um, oil warning light started flickering every once in a while, just flickering. And I went home and I checked the engine oil and I have a funny feeling this engine oil has not been changed despite the fact that the car was overhauled, as you know, some time ago. Uh, went in before MCO and came out just after MCO. So I'm here at Ken's place and he is uh, recommending I change to this new oil, 20W50. Of course, it's an older car, I don't need fully sin. So this will this will do fine actually. And um, yeah, I wanted, to, I wanted to, you, to show you the oil that was actually um, in the car. The most recent thing that was done, uh, as you can see, that's brand spanking new. I got uh, new clutch uh, pumps, top and below. Uh, that one, the brake pump was actually changed uh, some time ago. But uh, <laughs> the, the brake wagon's been running beautifully. I mean, she starts up at one crank. In fact, I just, I just told uh, somebody here just now who was commenting on my car that if this car doesn't start up with one crank, then there's something wrong. But she's been starting up with one crank. And, uh, oh yeah, <laughs> been, I've had this sticker for years. So I figured it was, this was the most appropriate car to put this sticker on. But yeah, just a quick update. And yes, I have been using her as how God and the car gods intended. I have been using the, uh, the space, as you can see. Uh, this was a, a very nice media gift from Caltex a long time ago. I've had it for, for ages. It's actually a, a separator for your boot. So, yep, these are all my parts for the Saga that are in here. So yes, this car is carrying parts for other cars, which is, which is kind of cool. And there was something else here earlier, which I've already... Uh, gotten rid of but it's left its uh, telltale packaging yep anyway sorry so yes the car has been used is being used uh, oh some bad news it fell off and uh, yes I've managed to get a replacement but I need to refurbish it a little bit I don't know where it fell off it fell off one of somewhere and you know what I actually tried to go and look for it but uh, it was gone so I removed the other one as well just in case it, it fall, fell off as well so the others are still around as you can see but those center caps are incredibly hard to find so if anybody has them please uh, sell them to me <laughs> I'm starting a collection of Volvo center caps just in case they fall yeah just like how I've got uh, spare center caps for the Saga yeah I need to start a collection of spare center caps for the Volvo as well but uh, yep so just a very very quick update uh, I've got new reflectors as you can see for the uh, for the headlights, I got that uh, recently from KK, Mr. KK at AME Auto Parts. Very nice, so the lights are much brighter at night now. So yeah, it's an ongoing process. I don't do everything at once, you know. I like to enjoy small upgrades as they happen. Yeah, so this is, this is how it goes. So um, be patient, lots more coming because, you know, I haven't even started really on the savvy yet. But uh, thank you Momo Racing uh, for the oil. I will be testing this to see how uh, how it performs in this old car. It's mineral based of course and it's an old engine so I don't need fully sin or even semi sin. Just nice. So yeah, anyway just a very quick three minute update. Hope you enjoy that. Thank you for watching. Stay tuned. Lots more to come.